Hello, my name is Haley, and I film lifestyle, career, and travel content. Welcome, and let's get started with this week in my life. guys i hope you are all doing well today is monday february 14th so happy valentine's day so as mentioned i am filming a week in my life work from home week in my life um i've done a lot of these uh but day in my life versions so if you want to go check out my channel they're on there and i have just been doing a bunch of emails and uh figuring out what's really important to get done today and doing a weekly monday team call so that's kind of been a busy kind of morning um i did take friday off so i had not only a three-day weekend but just had to catch up from a normal weekend of emails and all of that friday we did go to like this tent retreat um just for a night and i actually vlogged it and that vlog should have just gone up on my channel so if you want to go check that out then it was a very relaxing uh, peaceful kind of vlog and night so it's really fun um definitely well needed but needless to say, I've been a little foggy minded this morning on this Monday. So let's hope that I can get it together for the rest of the day and have also a great week. I've actually been working on a couple of projects at work, um, you know, with different accounts and just trying to really figure out the processes still. If you've been following my career journey, I just started with this company a couple of months ago and then just got into role about... A month and a half two months ago so it's definitely still been like um, a getting used to transition period and uh, I'm still learning every single day and uh, I really like to like vlog the journey so that is exactly why I'm doing this and I love to you know do this to be able to look back on it to hopefully help you guys so if you ever have any questions or concerns regarding um, sales tech sales marketing post-grad even if you're still in college because i am just a recent post-grad then definitely please leave them down below i would love to help you and also go follow my instagram you can always feel free to dm me um, i will put it on the screen but it is also h three a's y dot l three e's y so that is my Instagram. Feel free to go follow me on there just to see more of what I do day to day and go see my posts on there. So anyways, um, like I mentioned, it's about lunchtime. I do have a couple of things personally that I want to get done so I can show that and then we will get back to the work day. So I was just in a Zoom meeting and I get a knock on the door and I'm like, what could that possibly even be? Let me show you. So my mom sent me this really beautiful bouquet. Um, obviously I said earlier it's Valentine's Day. So I thought that was really pretty. Speaking of getting sent something, I actually have a little unboxing right here. So I can show you what this is. So I had the brand Dog Illy reach out to me. It's like dog, D-O-G-I-L-Y. Go check out their Instagram. You can see all of the cute um, pictures of all the people and the dogs wearing the products but i can show you what they sent me here so it was super nice of them to send me this has a cute note in it and then there's actually three boxes and these boxes this packaging is top of the line i mean it is very very nice packaging um i definitely will be keeping these boxes they are just like this like sturdy material and then they like pull out very beautiful I actually have Maverick right here and we are going to try them on and show you guys what they're looking like and this is just one of the many designs that they have and yeah so let's do it. The reason I like these is because it is 100% silk so they are very nice quality, temperature controlled and uh, they are strong and durable as well um, and they are just super lightweight so like I said packaging really nice. Um, it actually had three pieces, so this is the scrunchy part. This one is Maverick's piece, so it's actually um, a bandana that we will tie around his neck in a second, but this is the look of it. Super cute. I chose this design uh, for the colors, um, and I just thought it would look really good on both him and in my hair. 
And then here is the last box. Super nice. Look, I wish you guys could feel this. It's so soft, and if you've been following me for a while, you know how much I love silk, so I will definitely be putting this in my hair and matching with Maverick. So, so if you would like to match with us, you can go to docilly.com slash alex94 and get 25% off today and match with us. Um, so yeah, let's try it on. So this is the scrunchie with the hair scarf. So you could really adjust this to any length you want. Like I would maybe make this shorter um, and you could do a cute half up or a ponytail. Obviously right now this is not an outfit I would wear with it, but like wearing like a sundress or um, something along the lines of that would be super cute with this, I think. But yeah, so this is what it's looking like. Super soft and good for the hair. And so how I did that was um, it's just separate pieces. And so you can do just the scrunchie. You could put this on at your wrist to match uh, with one in your hair or and or one with your dog. Um, and then here's just like the separate hair scarf. You could even tie this into the ponytail and just use the hair scarf if you didn't want to do it with the scrunchie. You could use this with um, another hair tie. You could wrap this around the dog and put put the hair scarf itself around and kind of make like a cute uh, like knot kind of like kind of like the bandana and then as you saw Maverick wearing the bandana I could use this in my hair as well so very versatile pieces um, very nice all together and as I mentioned, you can get 25% off. I will also have it down in the description box. Yesterday was Super Bowl, so naturally I am eating pizza, wings, which this is uh, mild buffalo wings, and then pepperoni pizza on Cajun crust. And naturally with a football plate and napkin. So going to have this with ranch and watch YouTube, and then we'll get back to work. I've just been watching Carter Sullivan and other YouTube videos um, on my lunch and to finish off my lunch I'm actually going to I'm actually going to finish meal planning for the week and placing a grocery order so I was just going to actually show a little bit of how I do that um, in case you are curious I have showed this in another blog before but in case you haven't seen it just get on my Mac and I go to you know, I choose Walmart, but I know a lot of places are doing this now. To walmart.com, choose my, um, reserve my pickup time, and then I have a running list that I use every week, and um, whenever I think of something, I just kind of like note it down, um, a list on my notes app in my phone, um, and it's just like a checklist, and then I go through and uncheck and check as I add things to my as I add things to my cart so anyways and then I'll just have like a list at the top with my um, meals for the week breakfast dinner snacks all of that and that is how I, I ensure that I save money every week um, not eating out a lot keeping food in the house and yep so I'm just gonna go ahead and place that now then we will get back to work Hey guys, time for a little snack. I've been uh, working on some emails and I'm um, going to some meetings and I'm going to be eating the Trader Joe's organic roasted teriyaki seaweed snack. Um, these are a super great snack, very addictive, very, um, 
you know, light and crunchy and salty and just super good. Um, and then I did just post a Trader Joe's haul and ratings uh, TikTok. If you want to go check that out is want to go check that out and follow me on there um one of my this is one of my accounts and it's Haley dot 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 smith um and it's also down in the description box but anyways I'm going to be eating this and you should definitely try these if you haven't yet it's super good okay i've been in a midday slump for about probably two or three hours now it is four o'clock um, and yes, it's later in the day. Normally I would maybe do this a little earlier, um, but I'm gonna do some afternoon caffeine, um, second set of caffeine for the day. I really do switch up what this is every day um, or every week really, like it's either energy drinks or a lot of times it's green tea um, or sometimes I'll go and get coffee a second time. This week I'm doing this. Um, it's not the most strong thing ever, but for a second, dose of coffee for the day it's fine Before I end off this work day today, I'm going to be doing, I'm going to be making a list of to-do list for tomorrow, um, just so I can kind of in the morning not be stressed about what I have to do and uh, follow up on some certain things. And yeah, so I'm going to do that. I don't do this every day, like definitely not, um, but it's definitely a great thing to do if you have the time. Um, and yeah, on my less busier days, I typically will do this for the next day so that I can get a lot done the next day. So let's do it. groceries and um, I'm gonna go inside now and cook dinner and take a that shower and really just relax for the night and I will see you guys tomorrow morning Happy Tuesday. It is about nine o'clock now. I've just been knocking some stuff out this morning and I'm actually time blocking. So I can show a little bit of that. I know I've shown it in um, my last video. It's something that I just, that was my dog. Um, something that I just recently started doing, but I can definitely show it in this video. So let's get to it. For privacy reasons, I'll obviously leave it like back here. Um, but pretty much, today's the 15th. I did put an hour time block in this morning just to get stuff done. Um, and then I have this meeting. I think I'm going to put 11.30 to 12.30 lunch break and nail appointment. Okay, seriously been one of my favorite meals lately, especially leftovers for lunch. So just doing simple tacos. Add the cheese, the sour cream. The ground beef i really love to add black beans to my tacos now um you could replace it instead of eating meat if you um don't eat meat or you're kind of like me and some days you would rather not have it or not have as much of it don't even know if any of that was in focus sorry guys okay usually i would add avocado this one is not ready yet but that is super good in it as well with some salt pepper and lime juice some kind of hot sauce today we're doing sriracha and then the Taco Bell salsas are always so good. I really like the spicy ranchero lately. And yeah, there you have it. OK, 
Okay guys, I just went to the nail salon. I'm on my lunch break. Got my acrylics off because I got them filled a couple of times and they were just cracking and just not great. And honestly, I was kind of tired of wearing them. Um, I used to get manicures all the time and I would get just like gel put on my actual nails because I actually usually have very healthy nails. Um, but like I said, I just got these acrylics off. And can anyone tell me if it's normal? I don't know if the camera is picking up on it. But it's like all of my nails are super rough and have these like things on it. Um, I asked the nail tech and he said that it's because I just got the acrylics off, which sounds right. But at the same time, I really hope they didn't just ruin my nails. So if anyone knows, um, probably won't be making that mistake again. And it was also kind of sad just not getting my nails done, but going in. But I honestly just want to like give them a break. And I just feel like getting your nails done the cost of it adds up so much and I feel like this isn't talked about enough but I would rather spend money on experiences and things than like getting your nails done stuff like that um, products items consistently um, because it really adds up and it's not a forever thing like kind of memories and experiences are I've been that kind of person here recently as I get older and I think it's just how I think about things um, but yeah overall a little worried about these it made me laugh getting my valentine's nails off the day after valentine's day it kind of reminded me of like when someone takes down their christmas tree like the day after christmas you're like nope over it i kind of put them on a little early i keep looking around because there's a lot of people around but anyways i'm just gonna go home eat lunch which is leftover tacos from dinner last night i can show you everything i put on them because I've been making them to where I put a lot of toppings on it and it makes it so good. So I'm really excited for that for lunch and then we will get back to work and finish out this work day. this every day but today's breakfast let me show you today's breakfast is one or two scrambled eggs and just a hash brown one of those frozen ones you can get at the grocery store with some hot sauce salt and pepper on it so i'm gonna eat this and then get back to my meetings hi guys i am kind of sad i had this like big motivation to vlog this entire week um so i started monday and then it went really strong monday tuesday wednesday comes which was yesterday and i got super crazy busy and um we all know plans just don't always go as planned so that kind of happened and i just didn't vlog i don't think i got any clips at all um but pretty much just had a busy day at work and then after work um i worked later and then just got tired and did all my stuff my boyfriend and i made baked pasta for dinner and then um binge watch this show called Reacher on Amazon Prime. Super good show and um, I highly recommend it. But now it is Thursday and it's actually later in the day than I would even want. So pretty much just added on to my Wednesday um, problem too with not really vlogging as planned. But here we are, I'm trying. But anyways, just been having manager meetings um, a team meeting and then now I'm about to get on the phone with a bunch of customers and just call out and really try to get a hold of some people that I've been trying to get a hold of. Um, 
account plan and follow up on some leads that I have in the system. Just really try to clean up the pipeline. If you know sales or if you are in sales, you're familiar with it, then you definitely know what I mean. Um, really gotta make sure that pipeline is clean and updated, um, especially for management when you have these meetings. So that's pretty much what I'm doing. I'm wearing a cozy outfit again today. Did not do my hair or makeup like I planned to. Wanted to curl my hair and do my makeup, but it has been super nasty weather today, like storms and kind of chilly. So that's the weather and the situation today. But what I'm wearing, just this little crop top from Target. Um, my cozy all-time favorite cardigan from, honestly, I think Target too. I think it was like two years ago. And then I just have some black sweats on. But anyways, it's lunchtime now. I will probably be eating soon. My light bulb is out. Yes. So I actually moved this lamp. I stole it from my boyfriend's desk and brought it into mine. That is why the lighting looks like this. But anyways, I am so tired. You can tell in my voice. I haven't really slept in like three nights. So the past two days have been a little rough for me. But anyways, let's step away from this computer. And hopefully I will get better vlogging clips today. So I'm sorry about that. Just now getting around to ice rolling my face, but I guess it's better than not doing it. But here we are. Can really wake you up too, just by the way. it is a little bit later now and I'm ordering some stuff on Amazon like I said I was so um, I'm getting like this like magnetic screen door just um, for the patio door and then um, some skin stuff so this is like pretty random Amazon cart right now um, but I want to start razoring my face again so I'm getting this one it's like the uh, I think it's Schwick or something like that, Hydro Silk um, razors, and then the Paula's Choice Skin Perfecting 2% Cid Exfoliant. Um, I'm just getting a travel size for now. We'll see how it is. But if you've used this, please let me know. Um, I've been reading reviews, and I've been seeing some really good ones. So I figured I would give it a try. Just go ahead and get like the travel size one. Use it maybe every other day, and I can definitely let you know how that goes. But yeah, I'm just going to keep, maybe, you know, I might get some stuff for my trip next week and then sit here and watch Summer House and then I will probably see you tomorrow. guys it is saturday now i'm continuing this vlog going to be doing some fun things this weekend so i will definitely show you know what i show i know that this has been like the most random messiest inconsistent vlog i've probably ever done but you know what we're sticking with it i'm getting ready right now um doing my makeup putting on actual clothes today i would do my hair but I just washed it and I also don't know I really want to try hair rollers again I keep seeing people use them I ordered some on Amazon a few weeks ago but I haven't really been using them I think I tried it twice and it just failed each time so but I think I want to try again I just didn't give myself enough time today so maybe I'll show that tomorrow and just do it when I wake up and let it sit for a couple hours um, but anyways done all my makeup that I'm gonna do for the day um, I just have blush to do. So I actually just got this recently, the Glossier Cloud Paint. Just take it, and it's definitely pretty scary at first. I'm not um, one to usually use liquid makeup, 
but I want to kind of get into it. But yeah, it's definitely messy. You definitely have to kind of, you know, really work with it. But once it's in, it looks pretty good. Not bad. Um, I'm going to do the other one and then and we will go have a good Saturday. Okay, guys. Just got this Amazon package. If you remember um, earlier in the vlog when I was ordering this stuff. So let's open it up and let's see. Okay. I know it said travel size, but this is pretty small, but I'm assuming it still can last kind of a while. Um, glasses. The razors um, I'm going to use for like my peach fuzz and my eyebrows. And the door thing. What I'm most interested right now in seeing are these glasses. They're definitely different than anything that I have. Okay, so it is a two-pack and I got it in the black and the tortoiseshell one. Let's see. They're cool. <laughs> I don't know how I feel about them on me. Let's try the black pair. I'll probably be wearing these more often. Okay. They're giving me like grandma biker. So we just went to a dog park. Um, sitting in the car now, we went and got food as well. Just grabbed some like fast food. It wasn't anything special. Um, and then hopefully we find some patio furniture. We've been on the look for patio furniture online. Sorry if you hear that noise. <laughs> um, we've been on the hunt online, but oh my goodness, guys. Do y'all see all these ducks in the parking lot. I'm kind of terrified to back out now. Anyways, um, we've been looking for patio furniture online, but can't really find one um, in our, you know, budget that we want with the design we want. So we're gonna go in stores. So we did end up putting in the screen um, that I showed you that I ordered off Amazon. Um, it's just like the magnetic ones if you've seen those. And it's amazing because Maverick's already used to going in and out of it. Um, so I've just been kind of sitting on the patio enjoying the fresh air. It's such beautiful weather. I don't know if I've actually shown the outside yet, um, but we did buy this patch of grass when we got him. And it's so funny because he does not understand to go potty on it, but he does go and like lay on it and sit on it. Um, so that's kind of what he does with that, but I just thought it was super funny. It's just kind of like over in the corner over here by our patio set. Anyways, it's about five o'clock on Sunday and I'm drinking some wine, editing on the patio. It is beautiful weather. The sun is setting soon. I really sucked at vlogging today and really this whole vlog, um, but today and yesterday, I pretty much just spent a lot of time with family, um, just trying to enjoy some time with family. So like my Nana, my pop, my mom, um, my dog, my boyfriend, just spent a lot of time with people. Um, today went to lunch in the movies. And now, like I said, just spending some time outside with my dog. And I need to finish editing this video. So I'm going to go ahead and close it out. If you watch this whole vlog, this super messy, unorganized vlog, I really appreciate it. And you are awesome if you have made it this far. And definitely subscribe if you are not already. Not all my videos are this super unorganized, so um, maybe you can find some more, you know, different energy in my other vlogs. But yeah, I have lots of other vlogs on my channel. Work from home, not work from home, all of that. Um, and yeah, I would really appreciate if you stuck around. And leave down below if you like these longer vlogs. I think this might be the longest vlog I've ever done. Um, it's looking like it's about 30-ish minutes. I could be wrong, but yeah. Let me know if you kind of like the 10 to 15 minute range or like above 15 minutes, 15 to 30, whatever. But yeah, I'm gonna let you guys go. 
and I hope you have a great rest of your day, a great week, and definitely stick around for my Cancun vlog coming soon because I'm about to leave. All right, see you later. Bye.